Hello friends, welcome to CEBBD tutorials. In this class, we are going to learn how to draw the plan and elevation of the dog legged staircase. Let's go to AutoCAD. Okay, if we come to the plan of the staircase, it's the stair all of size. Uh, internal dimensions will be 5500 by 3000 millimeter. Next, uh, the wall width will be of 300 mm. And here the door is provided, opening is provided, it's of size 1200 mm. Here the landing width is 1500 mm and total tread width is 3000 mm. And the clear spacing at the entrance will be 1000 mm. And these are the steps uh, where rise is 150 mm and tread is 300 mm. Okay, let's draw it in CAD. First, take units, UN, enter. Take type as decimal, precision 0 0.00 and the unit as millimeters. Click OK. Next, take rectangle command. Click D enter and provide a dimensions of 5500 by 3000. Click. Then take the offset command. Provide an offset of 300. Click here and click outside. Press space bar to cancel. Then select these two, explode it by X enter. Next, take the offset command, provide an offset of 1500. Select this line, click here, press space bar. Again, press space bar to select the same offset command. Then provide an offset of 1000, enter. Then click this line and click it here. Then take the line option and draw a line from the center of this line to the center of this line press space bar then select the trim command right click then trim these two lines then select these two lines go to the mirror command click at this point and move your cursor towards the left click and press enter now select these two lines now here this since it is a sectional plan, these steps will not be visible in this flight. So we need to make it as dashed lines or dotted lines. So select these two lines and go to the layer option and select dashed lines. Then press escape. Okay. Now select this line and press and by holding the shift button, click on this line. Now click on the path array option click on this path and here between distance provide a tread width of 300 mm click enter then close the array then select this whole thing and explode it by x enter next select the line command draw a line here then go to the offset command provide an offset of 1200 enter then click here click then take the trim command right click then delete these two lines so trim these two lines okay now go to the edge command select the double line pattern and click here now here it is closely packed so increase the scale here just press and hold it the scale will automatically change okay it's enough then close it now <coughs> let us learn how to draw the how to draw the sectional elevation of dog legged staircase for that i will go for offset option then uh, click on draw option then select this line and click it here then spacebar again click spacebar and provide an offset of some 500 click this line and click it below again spacebar to cancel again press spacebar to repeat the same command and provide an offset of 3300 divided by 2 enter select this object and click here press spacebar now select these three lines now select these three lines and take the mirror command, click it here, 
and move your cursor towards left click and press enter now draw a line from this point to this point and take the offset option and provide an offset of uh, um, how much wall width the 300 Okay. then delete the top line and the bottom line go to the command window and type br now select a break line give the size as 100 mm and the extension as 100 mm now click from one point to the another point and press enter like this here also spacebar from one point to the another point click enter now once it is over select this entire thing by window selection click on the mirror command and go to the midpoint of this line click it move your cursor below and click enter okay. now go to the line command steps and draw one reference line Again press space bar. Now go to the end of these steps, click and draw another reference line. Okay. Now select an offset command and provide an offset of uh, 150 mm and click the line, click it below, click below, click below, then escape, then take the line command and uh, draw an inclined line here again here also draw an inclined line now take the line command and uh, provide a rise of 150 mm and a tread width of 300 mm press enter escape now select this step and uh, Click on the path array command. Now click on the curve. Just close it. Again select it. And click on this point. And move it to this end point of the first line. Then close it. Ok we got it now. Now select. Explode it by X enter. Now select this line and delete it. Now select all the steps by window selection, click on the mirror command, now go to this point and move your cursor towards left, click and press enter, ok. Now click on the top line and delete it. Okay, we got the things now. Now once you got all these things, remove these two lines, ok. Select the offset command, provide an offset of 150. Click, click it below. Here also click and click it below. And uh, take the extension command, EX, enter. Again, another one time, press enter. Extend it. Here also extend it. Now take the trim command and uh, trim this portion off. Okay. Once you've trimmed all the things, uh, now select the offset option, provide an offset of 15 mm, then uh, select uh, these lines, click, click inside. Select this line and click it inside. Select this line and click it inside. Again like that. Uh, click, 
inside click inside click inside then press escape now select the pilot command and provide the radius of 15 mm enter now select the first line and the second line press space bar first line second line like that here also press space bar first line second line press space bar first line second line now select this line and delete it here also select this line and delete it okay now go to the extend command ex double enter now extend it okay here also extend extend it extend the thing once it is extended press escape now go to the trim command right click now trim this portion okay, press escape select this line delete it now again here also select this line and delete now take the line command and go here go to the second step intersecting point and search for the perpendicular point ok once you get the perpendicular point click here press escape now press the space bar to repeat the same command go to the second step click here search for the perpendicular point then click escape now take the trim command then right click now trim this line escape now take the pilot command right click pilot command click on the first line second line here also press space bar first line second line now delete these lines now take the circle command Take the circle command and draw a circle from this point of radius 15 mm. Then select this and click copy and take the midpoint as the base point and paste it here. and paste one circle here also now select this and click on the move command press anywhere here and move it till you get perpendicular point ok now select this point and click on the path array and click here and provide a between distance as 250 mm then press space bar again select this one click space click this line and provide a distance of 250 enter then again like that uh, select this press space bar select this curve provide the intermediate distance as 250 enter again select this line press space bar select this curve give the distance as 250 enter press space bar select this press space click on this curve and provide a distance of 250 enter now select this press space bar click on this curve provide a distance of 250 now select this press space bar click on this curve and provide a distance of Okay. Then close the array. Now select the whole thing and click X and explode it. Now delete the unwanted circles. Okay. Now this thing, this one, and this one. This
this one is unwanted we deleted the whole thing now we need to draw the and rails okay before drawing the and rails let us uh, trim or delete the unwanted lines this line is no need delete it these two lines select delete let us draw the and rails now for that uh, take the line option go here and uh, draw a line of 750 mm click enter next go to this point and press space bar and draw a line of 750 mm enter next select this line and click on the offset button and take the throw option and click on this point okay now again press space bar select an offset of 40 mm and click on this line click on this line and click on this line now take the jumper option here go here click on the top line and click on the left line again press space bar click on the bottom line and click on the inside line press space bar top line right side line bottom line and inside line okay now we got the and rail now select this thing by pre-selection click copy and click it here and paste it somewhere else now select this thing and click on the mirror command take this point and click now in the command window it is asking we need to erase the source objects or not click s yes. now select this whole thing and click move click move select this point as the base point and go to your drawing and click here okay now select line option select line option and draw a line here now provide an offset of 40 mm click click here then take the extend option by pressing ex double enter then extend this line now take the line option and uh, draw a line from this point to this point okay now select uh, these two lines click on the path array next click on this curve and uh, distance we don't know inclined distance for that what i am going to do means select this grip point okay select this grip point and move it till this point end point then click close the array now select this line and delete it okay now you can observe we got the and rails completely okay this concludes uh, the plan and elevation of the dog legged staircase thank you for watching the video